actually saw a few comments like this of people that seem to not realize that Selma Blair was a total piece of shit. Let me show you something she said back in February because this is not the first time that she has been openly Islamophobic and racist. So back in February on some guy's Instagram post, I don't remember whose Instagram post it was, she literally wrote, thank you very much, deport all these terrorist supporting goons. Islam has destroyed Muslim countries and they now come here to destroy mine. They know they are liars, twisted justification. May they meet their fate. That's like deranged. And what's with the fucking old English? May they meet their fate. Ma'am, this is Instagram, not an audition for Bridgerton. I think actually at the time that this happened, I made a video about it, like both about what she said and her pathetic apology, but I'm sorry. You're not gonna try to get away with this. Like, first of all, I ain't reading all that, okay? Second of all, it's so fake because there, this tweet that she originally had was so insane. It was just, it was so many levels of hatred and Islamophobia and anti-Arab racism all up with like a conspiracy that like the Muslims are coming to like poison the mind. Like, have you been spending all your time with like Elon Musk on 4chan? Like what? So yeah, this is not the first time that her or any of her washed up compatriots have done something like this. They have been on Islamophobic, anti-Arab tears for months and months and months. You just don't hear about it that much because let's be real about this. Our country doesn't care about Islamophobia. Like we just don't. We'll be like, oh my gosh, we're so like upset when someone's racist, unless you're Arab. And then like, I mean, it's kind of understandable cause like terrorism. Cause she should have been canceled like for real, for real as soon as she pulled that shit. Although she didn't really have a career anymore anyway. So I guess canceled from what? <laughs>